So what's the benefit of training it this way with the Espada Daga? You can discover the range of your weapons. Yeah, because we've got two different ranges now, don't we? Okay. So in talking about range, something that's really important, when you have a shorter weapon, where should you be in relationship to the staff? Inside. Say it again. Inside. Inside. It's absolutely correct. I don't want to be, when he swims that staff, I don't want to be blocking here. This is, I should say, bad idea is written on the side of the staff right here. Okay? So we want to make sure that we get in. So now I have my thrust on my knee shot. Okay? So we want to make sure that we understand that range. So I always try to stay inside the range, which means he has to keep moving back out, right, to get into a range that he can strike me. And that's why you see he keeps kind of scooting backwards and we get closer and closer to the wall over here because he keeps trying to scoot out to use his range. And so you're gonna, you should constantly kind of have this, one is pushing forward and one's pushing back, because I'm always trying to enter, 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 and get to the side, or get inside the striking, edge, or the striking end of that weapon. Mm -hmm.